At Shade 45, it's the morning after. I'm Angela Yee. It goes face killers here. Welcome, Yo. welcome, welcome, welcome. I have to say, Ghost, I'm, I'm impressed. I was like, Ghost ain't coming at no damn 8 o'clock in the morning. I was coming, yo. I come. When I work, now I go front. When I work, I work. Um, So, is this this next album that you're doing, right? You said this album is something that you wanted to do. It's not really even about the fans. This is something that you wanted I to wanna do. I want to do this shit. Right. You know what I mean? It's like, yo... I, done, I told you, I done, I done kicked all types of street shit, B, talked about spots, cracks, getting shot, all types of shit, you know what I mean? But it's like, this shit right here, man, this this, this R&B shit, it's like, yo, when I did shit like with Carl Thomas, you know what I mean, even the Joe C remix, little few lines I had on Beyonce's couple summertime, of records. Summertime. You know what I mean? <laughs> even I had a Me, Myself, and I remix, that was, the verse was kind of crazy on that shit. Uh, to the left, to the left, shit. Oh, right. You know what I mean? Uh, 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 Irreplaceable. You know, uh, all that shit. One twelve. All I got is you. The neo shit. You know what I mean? You do this Baby already. Face shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. I, it's like it's like people like when I write stories. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And my message when I write a story comes across real well, whether it's fiction or reality. You know what I mean? So I feel that I got, I feel that I could get my shit across on some growing man shit. You know what I mean? It ain't all, this album right here is not just all about, all right, yeah, it's a love album, but it's like you got certain situations too when your woman is, you know, with the next nigga around your kids and it's like, yo, you hurting. Mm -hmm. You miss it because you fucked up. Now you lonely now. Right. You know what I mean? So it's got, you got other different type of, you know, situations that men go through and shit like that. So it's like, it's time to like get on some growing shit. And I'm like, I'm saying it's like, yo, I'm older now. I was I was a young nigga coming in, kicking all that. I don't kick so much shit is ridiculous. But it's like you gotta grow. Something like what Mary J. Blige did. You know what I mean? She fucked around and had all that 411 shit, but when she came with no drama, just she started come becoming a woman. Right. You know what I mean? And talking about woman's situation and things and this and that and the third. Back then, she was the wild Mary, which we all love, though. But at the same time, yo, you're, I can't stay, stay 25 all my life. Mm -hmm. Now, not to say that I'm not going to kick that shit, you know what I mean? That, that other shit on other shit, you know what I mean? Right. But I got to start coming up, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm getting wiser. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So I, I can't, I got to stop limiting myself to all that other shit and start talking about real situations. Why women... For instance, like why a woman, uh, you know, is in the club every fucking week or take one dude a home a month. That's 12 niggas in one year that she fuck. Well, you understand uh, what I'm saying? Guys have but, done way worse. But, but I'm just saying, though, <laughs> but I'm just saying, though, but for a female, right. that's not nice. That's not nice. It's not nice for a guy no. either, though, Ghost, listen, just so you listen, know. If he ain't got no girl. Or whatever, whatever. It's, it's still it's still not nice for a female. See, that's what's wrong with our people and shit. They put our women equal to men. We're not equal. That's coming from me, nigga. We're <laughs> equal. Don't put me equal. You know what I mean? I was here first. For real. You know what I mean? But this is how I feel. What? I feel... Don't yell at me, ghost. No, but I'm just saying, though. It's too early for this shit. I just feel like this. Guys shouldn't do that shit either. Listen. I, I don't respect that either. Listen, but I'm just saying, though. If a female, if you ain't even got a guy, mm -hmm. and you take one dude home, one dude home, say, say for a month, a month, that's 12 dudes you done fucked in a year. What you gonna be in five years? But what about, this is now, this is how I look not at it. Not even including the niggas that you done fucked before that. <laughs> Somebody like Superhead, right? That was going around. Everybody knew uh, her nickname. Yeah. Everybody okay. knew what she was doing. And right. dudes still wiped her up. She's married now. Right. Those are those dudes, though. You know what I'm you know saying? What I mean? It could those happen, are those though. Dudes, though. I'm sure that you've you know been. What I mean? I'm sure that you've been. Who wiped her up? The guy, what's his name? Um, I would have never wiped the that. The actor. I would have never wiped Eddie that. Eddie Winslow. I would have never wiped that. She has so many dicks in her mouth, B. I would never wipe that. But I'm sure you've been That's with girls wrong. in your past that have been hoes and you probably knew it and still, you it's know. It's not. I'm talking about the female. I know. I'm, you, you know what I mean? If but you, I'm if saying you've wiped, that you wiped a hoe before, like, no? Listen, I never wiped a hoe. Never. Are you sure? I never wiped a hoe. Never, ever, ever, ever. Maybe you didn't know it. I, matter of fact, I, I don't even got a wife, B. You know I don't I mean? mean a wife. No, but I'm, <laughs> you I'm, know I'm, what I mean. I'm, but I'm just saying, though, I never went in like that. That's <laughs> not That's not me. You know what I mean? You could fuck a bitch and, and just fuck her. But, Continually but, and it's a relationship. And, not, and the next and, and thing and you know, you wiped her. all my out there that's listening, is, I'm not, when I say bitch, I'm not meaning like the disrespect. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? 
<laughs> hold on, hold on. I had 12 last month. You know what I mean? Oh, oh that's a dude, though. Okay. All right, listen. That's okay. But I'm just saying, though. You know what I mean? I, I ain't never, like, made one of those my, my motherfucking partner like that. You know what I mean? If I fucked a bitch and it was like that, then I just fucked her and I was there. She could have been a hoe. She could have been whatever, whatever. But I'm just saying, for a lady, a woman that's supposed to have respect and not just let anybody slide and enter her temple like that. You know what I mean? And even if she, and it's even worse, even if she got kids, a daughter, really. But you not. I don't think a female is supposed to be taken home. I mean, you could do what you want to do, but I don't think that... It's her nature, really, for someone who has respect for themselves to take a different face home every fucking month. Twelve motherfuckers, you fuck. If you, that's a more that's than the whole routine. Let me tell you, of course, yeah. in one fucking year. <laughs> the whole come group. on, yo, this shit is it's, it's ridiculous, though. All right, we're gonna talk more. With, with we gonna talk space. more about that when we come back. Nothing about how niggas be running trains on chicks, and I think that's disgusting. And how do guys yeah, do that? Shit. I think they're more disgusting than the female. All right, we get back on that. Shade forty-five. Shade.